So, EMC is so Len breaking. So Lenny uh, is EMC's head of social media. He runs the social city here, the Blogger Lounge. Hi, Len. Len, Hello. thanks for Len, coming our, in. Our, Len is uh, a our, friend of our ours. Friend. Nice to see you. Len He's, is in the uh, inner circle of the queue because it was here when Len Devana uh, was the inaugural gatekeeper and uh, friend who got us into the Blogger Lounge last year. Len. It, uh, so uh, New England clam chowder, right? That's what it took That's to right. get you in, right? <laughs> we got a big audience here. we got 2,500 people watching live, Len, and uh, we're having a great day so far. Tell so. them about EMC, social media, and all the stuff people might be seeing. And obviously, they've been seeing on the Cube. They've saw Bubba Blackwell jump on video. They've seen some Mini Cooper. So share with the folks out there about EMC's stuff. Sure. So we've upped our game this year. We're sitting here in Social City. Uh, in Las Vegas, and the Bloggers Lounge is a part of Social City. Uh, but just on the other side of the wall, we've got our, our EMC community network. We're actually broadcasting live, much like you folks are, uh, questions and answers and interview sessions. Uh, on the other side of that, we've got a, an area promoting our, our Facebook presence and Twitter. We've actually got 5,000 people signed up this week just to watch the EMC World keynotes on Facebook. It's really cool. Fantastic. You guys are taking a playbook out of the SiliconANGLE WikiBond formula, which is own the roadways. Just pump content <laughs> uh, into the cloud. I, I mean, think you're taking notes out of our book, frankly. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, the hey, other as long as it's good content. Yeah, no, we, we love it. For it right? <laughs> the other thing that's interesting, guys, and I don't know if we shared this with you before, but we've also um, we, we, we looked a lot at last year's EMC World, how much information was generated during the conference. Um, and we've got a ticker based on what we were able to prove out factually from, from last year. And we've thrown some assumptions in around uh, you know, amplifying uh, more buzz on Twitter and Facebook and whatnot. We're upwards of 120 uh, terabytes of information created so far in the past 36 or so hours. It's pretty Just cool. Just in the form of social media and it's video. It's like one of those tickers that like, a, like a New York City with the national debt you see kind of flying around. It's one of those things, but you're, it's, it's bytes or, or megabytes? Uh, it's being it's measured in megabytes, uh, nice. and as I say, we're up in the uh, uh, petabytes now, but it's uh, you folks were factored in, frankly. Uh, tweets, blog posts, Flickr images, uh, YouTube videos, presentations, sessions, everything you can imagine. It's just, it's staggering the amount of information that's generated in a show like this. Oh yeah, we will gen generate many, many, uh, many tens of terabytes. Uh, in a, in a, so in I'm reading on Twitter days. that there's 10,000 people in the hall, one hallway, because this uh, breaking records theme was the big mega launch uh, part of EMC. Um, anything else going on with EMC that you want to share with the folks out there? Oh my goodness! Hey, you know, just tune in. There, there's just so much going on. If you guys are free for the next four hours, just give I'd us be the happy highlights, the big, the big points, the big, uh, the big flash. What's the big flash here? Uh, you know, clearly the um, the open source announcement this week has been pretty significant. Yeah, yeah we were uh, talking we about that. Kind of like the blanket. Is that right? Is yeah. that yeah. not news to you guys? Yeah. 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 We've been we've been pounding that. It, Pat's Pat told us that he. He didn't get a ton of interest on that, but that's all we talked about, right, John? Last that's night. all we talked that about. That was great. We yeah. talked about that Hadoop thing all and day long. And is Paul going to be on? I, I missed Paul's keynote, unfortunately. No, no Paul we, had, will we not didn't be have on. Paul scheduled. We had, we had Tucci scheduled, but he had a... He had to reschedule, so we're not sure exactly when we're going to get him. But if you see him running through the bloggers, now, please tackle him for us. And, uh, you we'll, got me instead of Joe. Is we'll that not him on. Joe well, Tucci? We want, we want both. Oh, fair enough. Both. Fair yeah. enough. Okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> But uh, you know, this, you guys are doing a great job. We appreciate you taking the content and helping us broadcast it out there. And there's no shortage of channels. We're doing it, as I say, on Facebook, on our community network, on Twitter, on our blog. So, yeah, thanks a lot for what you what guys do you are doing. What do you think about the cube in general? I mean, what's your, what, are you, what are your thoughts off the cuff? Seriously, yeah. um, I absolutely love what you guys do. I love it. I love the setup. I think you're a uh, you're, you're just a pillar of our bloggers lounge now. And I can't imagine an EMC world without you folks here. I just love the model. Sincerely. Yeah, well. And they did not pay me for the endorsement, right? <laughs> Full disclaimer. Well, thank you. You know, Len, I've always liked you. You know, <laughs> I was, uh, Len's great, great, great. We always loved you, Len, and uh, you're a big part of our success. Thank you very much for the. Yeah, for we your know help how much planning goes into this. I mean, you look at this. It's this. It reminds me of the Denver Airport, actually. You know, the the it mountains, does. and it's a it's a great venue, really comfortable. A lot of people coming in and out. Um, it's a nice place to come relax, and uh, and I know the amount of planning that you put into it up front. The EMC amazing. brand is really, really upping. They're, they've mm -hmm. upped their game, and the brand is ex exp expanding to a new image, and I think that new image is well, well beyond what it was uh, a year and a half ago. I mean, as an infrastructure provider, EMC is, is really coming across as a leader, and uh, you know it's taking steps in all directions, marketing, social media, aggressiveness on new markets like Hadoop, um, and uh, I'm telling you, the management team is, is is on fire, and I think it translates through the organization. Well, I, I, I couldn't agree more, and I've been here with the company for 10 or so years now, and I think what's fascinating is I've actually watched the company change culturally, and in fact, you know, the notion of taking our keynotes, for example, in real time and pumping them out through the, through the web, we wouldn't have dreamed of doing that a few years back. 
Um, so it, it's, it's really exciting, and frankly, it's an honor to be part of this transform, transformation that you're talking about. Uh, it's been fantastic for us. All right, so we're here live with Len Devana, who runs uh, EMC Social Media Program. We're live at the Social City, which is inside the Bloggers Lounge. I guess the Bloggers Lounge is inside of Social City at EMC World. Just so much going on here. I mean, it's, it's actually incredible. I'm heading over tomorrow to the Data Scientist Summit. Yep. Um, you know, I got an invite to that. I'm going to squeeze some time in to go there. We got hundreds of data scientists. Uh, you didn't get an invite? No. I, I just asked. I said, sure, we, yeah. we'd love to have you. So, uh, so I'm really looking forward to that. Um, the keynotes here, I saw Napolitano in the gym this morning. He overslept, missed our cube, and messed up the time zone. But uh, he's going to try to come back here. Uh, we're going to try to get Tucci on. Uh, we had Gelsinger on last night. We got a great, great lineup today, actually. Uh, a lot of the partners are here. Um, very impressed with EMC's you know, partnership posture. I mean, obviously, you know, it doesn't want to own the world, just a big chunk of it, yeah. you know, that's important. And uh, yeah, so we're covering the angles here, siliconangle.com, wikibon.org. Um, anything else we should be looking for, Len? Well, let me ask you this, have you seen the uh, Vex Robotics competition just down the hall? No, but I saw that, uh, it caught my eye because um, yeah, I'm a big Dean Kamen fan. I don't okay. know if you know Dean, um, he's always been sort of a, a, a hero of mine and uh, and, and my old high school actually went very deep into the, into the Dean Kamen you know, robotic competition, so I saw that and I was intrigued. Tell us a little bit about what that's all about. So EMC does a lot uh, with Vex Robotics. It, it's a group, there, they're out there, and they, what we do is we, we give these robotics kits to school systems throughout the country, and uh, the kids are tasked with building a robot to serve a different purpose, to, to solve a challenge, if you will. So there's a, just a huge area right behind us, um, kids from uh, the western half of the U.S., uh, they've built a series of these robots, and they're, um, right now they're, they have to um, pick up a, a ring, move it across uh, the field, and, and drop it in another ring, and it's a competition. It's been going on all week. And I just, to, to, I just came back from a tour to see the passion in these kids' eyes. Um, they've got a kit. It's effectively an erector set, uh, and they've built uh, from scratch. They've designed and conceptualized this robot, and, and they've got, got them out there just doing amazing things. Uh, they're letting our, our customers drive robots around, um, and it's just, it's, it's an absolutely spectacular thing to see. And we, we should get you guys over uh, to get some exposure. It's yeah, so really this neat. is, uh, we should actually send a camera over there. So, so I mean, I, I don't know if people realize how much goes in mm -hmm. to this effort. So these kids must have been working on this for months, I would imagine. So it's a real software challenge to yeah. get a robot to, to pick up, you know, a device, to control the robot, to go to a device, to pick it up, to bring it back, and move it and put it into some, you know, whatever, some container or some bucket. Think about the software challenges, the hardware challenges, and I know from my personal experience at, at, with my friends at Millis, my friend's kids at Millis High School, that they would spend <laughs> literally six months programming these things, and they would have hardware teams, they would have software teams, right. they would have test and dev teams, and it's a really big deal. And the whole idea behind this when, when Dean came and started it was really around as a society. We celebrate sports heroes. We celebrate Dwayne Wade. We celebrate Kobe Bryant. We celebrate, you know, Lady Gaga. But we don't celebrate math and science accomplishments. Right. And so how do you maybe change the game? And so, you know, presidents from Clinton and, and Bush 1 and Bush 2, I'm sure Obama's been involved in this, have endorsed this concept. And it's great to see EMC. I mean, you know, this is a technology company. Technology is built on math and science. You know, we're constantly criticized in this country for not being competitive with India and China. And these are the kinds of initiatives that are really going to, you know, help us grow that base. Well, that's right, man. And hopefully we do get you folks over there because you will not find uh, a more talented, a more passionate bunch of, uh, a creative bunch of kids. Um, they're, they're living and breathing it. We've flown them in from around the, the country. And, and they just, the excitement is contagious, frankly. Yeah, they've got, I'm sure they've, you know, I know, again, from my experience, they've got cheerleaders. They've got, and it's, yeah. it is really a non-trivial exercise to get the robots to do right. this thing. So that's cool. Uh, let's see, anything else that we should be paying attention to? I mean, I know there's so much. It's there's just, there's just so much. I mean, I would say tune in online. There's, there's no shortage of things going on for folks who are unfortunately can't make it. Um, uh, iPad app. There's a new iPad app called Oh, Folio, Folio. is up. Folio. It's um, in the app stores of Sunday, and uh, it's a great way for you to tune in. I downloaded in it. It's nice. A couple of little, little bugs. I sent some comments in, so that's good. You know, Great. We'll make it better for next uh, next event, but uh, it's kind of a cool app. It is, and to John's point, you know, we're, we're testing new new grounds here, right? We're, we're trying yeah. new things, and um, and we're we going got, fast. We got a new site. Silicon Angle's a new site few bugs in there you know thanks for the comments out there so I think I, we had Greg Gotts on yesterday and he was talking about um, you know the coolness of EMC where EMC 
has never really done a lot of advertising, but they're really pushing the envelope in what our religion, Dave. And, and, and what's great about EMC that I love, Len, and working with you guys has been, and meeting Dave, who's known EMC for years on the analyst side, is that they're totally open-minded, but they're, they're very cool, but they're, they're also could be hard asses too. They're a hard-charging you know, culture. Um, but they're willing to try stuff. And they're, what, he, what Greg Goss and I were talking about was that new innovation around the sizzle, yeah. but also they recognize that the entertainment side of the business, that the consumers, your customers, EMC's customers, are normal people. They watch TV, they go to the movies, they do stuff, but they like sports. So why not take that programming yeah. on the net and, uh, you know, obviously I had my opinions about, you know, some of the right formulas there, and I think you guys are doing a great job, and I think it's about expanding, trying new things. If it fails, hey, shut it down. If it, whatever's working, you double down on it. So, you know, maybe the iPad doesn't work initially, but maybe you kind of figure it out, and when it does work, you double down on it. So, we've learned in social media that that has been a core tenant of our innovation, has been play with stuff yeah. and have a, have a single goal. And what I like about uh, you guys is you're like us, where our single goal is to provide a great user experience with content, yeah. original content, not spam, SEO. And from there, we work from there. We try new things. We're doing now multiple cams. We got <laughs> yeah, new setup, <laughs> the red lights. <laughs> um, well, and to your point, I mean, uh, it, it is all about experimentation, trying things and, and you know, going fast and calibrating on the fly. Uh, if we didn't have that sort of a culture mentality, we wouldn't be sitting here in the bloggers' lounge. So well, check this the, out, Len. So check this out. So I was telling Dave yesterday, this morning, check this out. ESPN, I'm showing a video of 1980. Huh. ESPN covering... So basically, yeah, ESPN covering Division Three uh, cross country. So a bunch of kids in shorts running in the mud. You know, that's what ESPN did in 1979. Raw <laughs> at the time, cutting right. edge. Yeah. We look back at that and going, oh my God. So I believe people are going to look back at what we're doing, what you're doing at EMC and saying, wow, but it was cutting edge of time. But as long as we're innovating, I think that's what the users respect. And like ESPN, who was covering sports at the time when no one was covering sports, was incredible. Our, ver our vision is to do that with tech. And uh, I'm really excited by SiliconAngle.com and Wikibon.org because as independent group, we can work with EMC in a very collaborative, transparent way that's never been done before. Yeah. You're not just an advertiser, you're a participant in our, in our flow. That's right. And vice versa, right? We're here, and so uh, we can be independent and participate. That's right. That to me is the future of advertising. And, and to that point, you know, again, kudos to you guys for, for trying new things. And, and likewise, you know, we're, we're taking our keynotes live and we're st sticking them on Facebook. No editing, you know, if someone sneezes, they sneeze. And again, that's, that's a bit of a leap for where we've been in the past, but it's a great thing. And again, we, we've 10,000 people here and 5,000 tuned in on Facebook right now. And it just speaks to the, you know, go fast, try it out, recalibrate on the fly. Yeah, we live in a beta culture where, you know, oh, that's beta right. is Lynn, the norm. Lynn, final question for you before you, you go, or we can talk before the next guest comes on. But there's a lot of folks out there. We have 3,182 people watching right now. A lot of uh, the syndication that we've been seeing has been coming from a new audience out there from Justin.tv and some mm -hmm. other outlets, and they're new to EMC. They might not have the 10-year window that you have into EMC. There's a big new power base moving out to California with Pat Gelsinger, Jeremy Burton, and his new crew, Greg Gotts, and whatnot on the marketing side. Tell the folks out there, what is the new modern EMC about? What is it? I mean, they've heard of Microsoft, they've heard of Google, they've heard of Facebook. They might not have heard of EMC. What is EMC today, the modern EMC? This is Len Devana's definition, and uh, Come on, Len. you'll get a slight spin. You talk to different folks, but you uh, know, be to, Len, be Len. To don't me, be, don't it, be it's the about speak. no. It's but it's about information, and, and I believe this firmly. I, it's why we we invest the time to have this this digital counter out there because I'm of the belief that you know we are all big data. Uh, I've just uh, filmed the, the the kids over at Vex Robotics. I've blogged about it. I've tweeted about it. I, you know. I, I'm generating more information as an individual. You know, at the end of the day, this is our digital universe just expanding uh, at an uncontrollable rate. And to me, that is what EMC is. We are at the center of all of this information. We protect it, we manage it, we store it, um, and we get it out there. And that it's, it's very exciting to me uh, personally. It's very rewarding um, because we live in an information society. And to be a part of, uh, of this ecosystem of, of content, uh, and clearly this is where the world's going, and you guys are proving it right in front of our eyes. Um, that is EMC to me. 
Excellent. Len Devana, thanks so much for coming on theCUBE. Thank you for having us here and being such a, a great host. We really appreciate it. Cheers to you guys. Thanks great, very much. Great for collaborating with you. Len Devana in charge of social media, social